guys, it's Queen Nisha, and in today's video, I will be reacting to me to the final episode of Kanasuba, an explosion on this wonderful world. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. There we go. That's a win. Yes. No fucking mess up playback. You were probably thinking it, Mega Me. We all know you, baby. Skirt. I don't like that smile. Right? Girl. Yeah, what you do? I mean, you did things in what's the face, right? D uh, Megami, what you do? You ain't doing anything but freaking uh, Celty slash Kira Summer slash Jolene, you know? I mean, y'all did ish last week, but. <laughs> And you gotta make sure it has wings. Or we need to find something, like, material to make wings. Perfect. Oh, okay. <laughs> At first, I'm like, what you about to do with the cat and the plush? You gonna give a bump? <laughs> Oh, baby. You want to do it now? Wait. Hmm? Are you? Cosmo? Can you?
<laughs> I like something is on me and I can't figure out what the fuck it is. Jesus. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Oh. You gotta find her, like now. think that that's cure summer in a nutshell mm -hmm. oh my god <laughs> There you go. Better than that is in Baker. I mean, because it makes the most sense. <laughs> Okay, she made it there. Thank God.
I, I think she was hoping for that, but, um... <laughs> Yeah, that was Megumi. I had a feeling that was not going to work, but that was distraction for Union. Lies, lies, L I E S, lies. Don't listen to him. Uh, oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. oh, my God, <laughs> baby. Oh, Ow, my butt. <laughs> ah, yes, you got it from the other pretty cure. You got it from Mega Man in the white. Oh my god. Sorry. I just gotta adjust. Oh, she heard everything, baby. Yeah, I know. That was the stupidest thing you could do, Yingy. -Yin. You never ask someone if they're awake. Duh. Especially if you want to confess something like that. But it was cute. It was wholesome.
Right? I mean, we, we don't have time for this! Now, you know, Aqua and Cosmo, like, back up the guild, like, bro, what the fuck? Why is this shit happening to us? You know, you know, you about to get in some real fucked up shit right now. Like, later on. Alright, Union, go get your girlfriend. So where? Bye. See you in the Pretty Care All Star movie. No. We're not going to see her in season three, are we? I mean, I would like to see Cicely in season three, but... <laughs> It's okay if we don't. I won't cry. But she will be back. And you know, by the time she comes back, you'll be in a girl! You'll be in a team! But you're three idiots. Now, they at least got to show her, like, finally coming up to Aqua and Cosmo. And of course, see? Yeah, you got the pretty girls walking past each other!
Oh my god. No, 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 we're good, we're good. <laughs> yeah, they were happy. <laughs> oh, baby. There you go. There you go. That's how you end it. That's how you fucking end it. Oh, no, no, no. She coming. She's coming. There we go. And we got to see their faces. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Okay. All right. So final thoughts on this. Th this was too damn good. You, we already knew it was going to be good because come on. I mean, you know, as someone who once again binged Kanesuba season one and season two years ago, I think like mid 20... 2017? Whatever the hell Isekai. Yeah finally popped up. And I was like, yeah, I hadn't... No, did I watch it before? I don't fucking remember. I think I watched it before I watched Issa. No! Watched it after. I think I did. I think I watched it. No, 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 no. I'm lying. No. I... Mm -mm. Did I? I think I did. I either watched it around the same time after Isekai came out and I watched it with Overlord or I watched it before. And I think I watched it before. Yeah, I had to. So, okay, yes. Like, beforehand, we already knew how hella funny the show was. And so, for Megamine to get her spinoff, like, you already knew going in how good this was going to be. And, I mean, it exceeded my expectations, of course, because, duh, it's fucking Megamine. And such. Now, I, I do love the fact is that it ends right where it kind of begins because I, my thing was, how the frick are they going to end this? Like, is it going to continue right on where season one is, where she officially comes in, or are we going to be like, do something else to kind of let it connect and then give like a little quote unquote preview to season three? I kind of would have liked a preview of season three into it, even though it was just now officially confirmed today that we are getting a season three. Thank you, fucking God. Um, but I mean, yeah, I, I just love it. I, I really will miss this a lot. I love the fact that, you know, yes, we got to meet characters and learn about some of these characters that, you know, either we got to see in the movie or, you know, brand new people who are just first <laughs> are newly being introduced, which you kind of hope they get, you know other appearances in season three, you know, <laughs> the pretty girl and such. So prayers, prayers, because I really now want to see literally Cecily, Megamine, Wiz, and Darkness all interact because pretty cure. You have a team. And when you look at the four idiots of two pretty cures, a rented girlfriend, and whoever else, Cosmo, like whatever else show he's in, because I don't really know whatever else to say you is in. So I'll probably find out by today. Um, and start probably watching other things that he's in, definitely. But, like, seriously, I'll, at, at the end of the day, this was good. I, I love that we got to see the whole origin of Megamine and her backstory. Because even when I was watching season one, season two, 
all those years ago. There were questions, even though, once again, as I say, Megamine was not my best girl. Darkness, duh. Um, but I still loved her enough where I was like, in Curing Minds, aka me, wants to know more about her. And the movie gives you that, but at the same time, it kept, it kept me wanting more. And so because I was like, I'm not going to read anything with this. I don't want to know until something comes out. Boom, you get your answers with a wish and stuff. And then, yeah, but like, damn, this is good. I mean, when you're looking at like, what was the top number one thing for this season? I'm not going to say what it was. I've already heard backlashes on some things where everybody says like, no, this was number one. And everyone's like, no, it was the show that ended on Sunday. Um, of course you have a lot, but I feel like this will be in the top, let's say five, ten, top three of shows that all aired this season that were really good, that were basically anticipated and such. But I mean, yeah. It, it was fucking hilarious. It's always going to be fucking hilarious because it's kind of stupid. Now, my thing for season three, um, in my opinion, I, I felt like, is it going to be like a couple of months after the movie? Of course, I don't think they're going to connect it with Isekai Quartet because even when Overlord season four came out like they didn't connect that because we all know like yeah isekai quartet is its own separate thing and yes we're con we're taking all the characters from these different series and that are iconic as fuck but it's nothing where it's like okay like for example when saga Italian the evil comes out for season two she's not gonna mention <laughs> none of the characters from any of the other series or with ReZero, they're not gonna mention anyone from there or same thing with kanasuba or either um, Kashitiro or any of them, they're not going to, or, or even fucking Chill Hero, none of them are going to be like, yeah, you know what, maybe we should speed dial Megamine. Or maybe we should talk to um, Tanya. Or <laughs> even, uh, um, Anos? Elios. No, I, I fuck it. I don't remember <laughs> too many names. But yeah, let's speed dial this character. They're not going to do that. I kind of wish they would. Because it'd be funny, but... <sighs> That's never going to happen. <laughs> and that hurts. But I mean, yeah, I enjoyed it from beginning to end. Honestly, we'll definitely miss this. Definitely probably will rewatch it. Um, Maybe... In a couple of months. Maybe about my birthday. Because... I already said I was going to rewatch season one and season two, um, whenever the heck season three got announced and stuff. So yeah, definitely that is going to be on that to do list for me. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards the entirety of kind of super an explosion on this wonderful world. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single night. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys all officially later on this week or slash weekend for the start of summer anime, next week for the continuation, and then next year for season three, which I'm guessing, in my opinion, I either want it to air in the springtime or summer as fall, whatever they want to do it. It's up to them. I mean, shit, that hurt. But who knows? But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.